you're going to have to forgive me because uh, yes, I'm elderly, uh, yes, I'm a nurse, uh, and I'm actually still licensed. Um, I've got dual nationality. I'm also an American uh, citizen as well as British. Um, so anyway, here's going. This is for, for the journalists. It's for Adam Bolting and uh, Beth Rigsby and Kay Burley. Um, really, you have people that can think. Okay, so Boris is a liar. That's a proven fact. As a journalist, he was fired for lying. Now, that means that he's actually part of fake news. Are you with me? So anyway, uh, the next thing is he's spoiled. So his girlfriend was screaming at him and uh, caused a, 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 a boorah and the police were called by the neighbours next door and they'd recorded what she was saying and she said that he was just, you know, spoiled. Well, my grandfather said a, a spoiled person is no good to man or beast except to the ones that spoils them. So he has no, he's no right to be in charge of the world, the world. So anyway, I'll be calling him out and uh, um, so he's not fit to uh, resume power, but uh, he got there by lies, okay? So that means great because um, that means he's a criminal. So it's easy for me to call him out every day. They always make a mistake. They always do in the very end. So do you want further confirmation? Sir Philip Pullman was asked by uh, Classic Puffins to write some essays about a, a, for COVID to make money. And uh, he wrote, a, it, it's all got to change. And in that, he tells it straight. These, these people are just Etonian boys. What on earth are they doing in there? And they should all resign. They should all be ashamed. So there's your confirmation. And that's what I'm basing everything on as well. Uh, so we need journalists to protect the right to protest um, and freedom of speech. Yet uh, neither journalists nor successive opposition can get the truth. He's, he's polarised the world. He's a criminal. Oh, he's a criminal, all right. Will he do it again? Is he dangerous? Absolutely. So, um, therefore, I will call him out every day. Now, November is Remembrance Day. The Empire fought and uh, they gave their tomorrows for our todays. Isn't that fitting that this is November and it's the 12th? And on the 11th, we had that day. So uh, I think that's fitting. So Greta Thunberg has been elected by the youth as a natural leader. Um, she she says uh, that she wants no more blah, blah, blah. Um, now, we've got one year to work towards keeping global warming at 1.5. One year. Um, and that's vital for the poor. Your, your friend from Madagascar has explained that uh, as far as the world is concerned, we have famine due to global warming for the first time. So therefore it's important. So thank you, Sky, for your kindness regarding our First Minister. <coughs> Nicholas, I've been there before you and let him know that we're behind him. So COVID is not going away. We have virulent infection and grief to attend to. In this year, people need to get that. So we cannot escape and Boris has polarised everybody so that he can control us all. Now, I thank the balance of the whistleblower for Facebook, Twitter and Square. Like all criminals, they slip up. Uh, she respects um, logarithms, which were invented um, by Napier as a mathematical way of calculating large numbers and was a precursor for the computer, okay? So Boris has polarised his own party to control. Oh, big, big mistake. So anyway, the key to the puzzle was said by the opposition 
um, on, on Sky MP. He hates rules, but he's supposed to be making rules. Have you got it? Because the answer is in the one words. So this is what he's doing. And uh, let me just see to the last wee bit. So that's really it. That's really it. You'll see when I post that I'm posting to um, Global Warming and the Young People. After that, prisoners. Listen, they've been locked up the first time. I knew they're locked up again. And they but for the grace of God, go a lot of us. So what does Scotland need? What does the world need? Listen, it's going to be an absolutely new world. A new way of thinking. So we've got the world together and let's take it from there. I've got to finish at that now. So keep things posted and um, I'm, I'll be coming in again because uh, I want to uh, have a talk to Greta and just leave it with her because I'll be in every day, every day to let everybody know where I'm going.